Hi everybody! Today, in this lesson, you have learned that digestion is a process by which the wheat food turns into nutrients. Okay? So let's see how this works. For today's class, I brought you a kind of experiment for you to do at home. You will need water that will resemble saliva, lemon juice, two containers, this for the mouth, a Ziploc bag, a stocking, a sock, and bread. Let's start. Here we got the mouth. Okay, food, which is the bread, will come into the mouth and we're going to break it down the same as teeth do. Okay, this is going to be mixed with saliva, which is the water. And this, little by little, we're going to break it down and this is going to form a ball or a bolus. You see? This has been mixed up with saliva, the water, and the bread. Now, with this tube, which is the esophagus, we're going to put it here into the stomach, which is our little bag. We're going to put this bolus into the esophagus, will go through the esophagus until it reaches the stomach. You see? The stomach, at the same time, will start making some movements that will allow gastric fluids to mix up with this new substance. Here we have the movements. And once this is ready, this will go into the small intestine. Oops, these are things that happen in a live session. Okay, it's getting into the small intestine. And then you will see it's here where the food trespass the small intestine and go into the blood. Look at this water. This is showing how the nutrients get into the blood. But you may be wondering what happened what is with what is here. What is left after the small intestine will pass into the large intestine. Wait a second. Which will form the fecal substances. Okay? And this is what will go out of the body. We're going to put it here. And that would be our fecal substances that will go out of the large intestine through the anus. It's a little bit disgusting, isn't it? But this is how our body works. I would like you to try this on at home. Goodbye.